In this video, I want to show you how to export a configuration file created in SoMove to an Excel spreadsheet. The first thing we need to do is open up SoMove. And then I'm going to open a project that I have already created. If you do not have a project, you're going to need to uh, go up and create a project offline. Um, I've already got a project that I'm going to open up, and it's under, I've got a folder under my documents called SoMove Files, where I store all of my files that I've created, and the project that I'm, I've created already is going to be ATV 61 Desk 45 ACC. This is a project that I created off of a uh, ATV 61 that I have up my desk, and I've set the acceleration ramp time to 45, that thus the name Desk 45 ACC. So I'm going to open that up. And uh, just to show you, um, I'm, I'm going to go over here to the Parameters tab and show you how it comes up in SoMove. This is a list of all the parameters that are in the ATV61. And notice here, this uh, acceleration, I have changed it to 45 seconds. And you can tell that I've edited this because of the little pencil mark in this column here indicates that it's been edited. It's been changed from the default to 45 seconds. Also, you notice up here I've changed my access level to expert as indicated by the little edit pencil there. So, one of the things I want to show you is that I like, I, I, this is good the way this is presented here, but I like the menu mode better. By pressing the menus, it, it organizes the different parameters in their respective directories. So, for instance, you can go into Simply Start and see all of the parameters that are in the Simply Start directory, just like all the other directories. You can go into the application function, and it gives a list of all the um, submenus and, and parameters in application function. So, once you've got this project open, the next thing you want to do is make sure that you are not connected. Notice up here that it does say that I am not connected, otherwise it would say uh, disconnect from the device, but right here it's asking me if I want to connect. I don't have my, my drive connected to uh, this computer right now, so I'm not going to connect, but notice um, if I was connected, I would have to press this disconnect from device before I could export this file. Now, now I want to export the file. I go here and click on File, come down here to Export, and then it, it, um, you hover over Export, and it brings up a list of three different file formats that you can export to. You can do it as a PDF, a text file, or an Excel spreadsheet. This is what I'm going to do today, so let's press Excel, uh, Export to Excel. And then uh, it takes me to uh, a window where I can open up or choose the path or the directory that I want to save this to. Um, since uh, I'm making a video today, I'm going to put it under uh, videos. And I have a directory under videos on PSG video FAQs, frequently asked questions. And um, since it is a video, I'm doing it under open broadcast. I'm going to put this uh, direct or the file in that that directory, um, and I'm going to name it ATV61. Oops, 6145ACC. Then once I click save, it'll save it and come up with another window that uh, tells me that it has been export, uh, exported successfully and ask me if I want to open the file, and I choose yes. Let's open the file, and here is a list of all the parameters in the ATV61 